patrimonios de un barrio fuera, a otros de business card, business card de uh -huh. I usually go to both because my profile is a mix of both uh, business and tech. But uh, the engineering career fair is excellent for those who are pursuing engineering at UIC. A lot of companies come and please focus on the fall career fair because the spring one isn't as great as fall. A very less number of companies come to uh, the spring career fair compared to the fall one because in spring there will be winter. Everyone in my batch, I would say like. 99% of them got an internship but you had to really struggle for it <laughs> LinkedIn should be you know like literally your main social media tool to be used after you come here so mm -hmm. you know like contact recruiters and connect with people and drop them a message say them that this is your background you are interested in an internship and you apply to like so I applied to like around 5 700 internships and I got like around 10 15 calls and I converted like five of them get a good internship that at least you have an assurance that this will you know convert into a full time job and um, will also sponsor you as well so I would say that whatever hard work that you have to do always like in the first year make sure that you are very much involved in your internship process Twenty one, twenty twenty one dollars is minimum. In my senior batch, I think almost everyone has a full time job, but uh, uh, so you don't want to go through third party consultancies, you know. So if you don't find a full time job at the till the very very end. So what the students do is they go to these third party consultancy companies that pays you like really very less and you know they don't sponsor your H1B and basically you don't want to go through all of that so mm -hmm. most of them like find a full time job at good companies average you should be not less than 70k for your because mm -hmm. if you are into programming if you are a data scientist then it should be minimum 100k mm -hmm. if you are into tech consulting business analyst project manager so depending on the company depending on your number of years of experience depending on their requirement i think uh, so in chicago if you get like 70k you can still live a uh, very you know Like decent life, and you save as well. But the same salary in California would be more because California is very expensive. Mm -hmm. So I say that always see to it that you know, like work hard and try to get at least you know like ninety k or ninety hundred k minimum hundred k I would say. Mm -hmm.